Today's episode of Podsky Outdoors comes to you from the Cherokee Indian Reservation where they stock every single week of the year. You know, we come up here because they have beautiful trout. You know, even the small fish that they stock are much better than state stock fish in a lot of places, you know, and it's better value. $10 for a day permit, which allows you to keep 10 trout. Now, we don't keep any fish here. We catch them release so other people can enjoy them and also because we're not gonna eat those fish. However, if you want to, so be it. Go ahead and do so. Oh, it's a good one. Nice one. You got a brook trout? Yeah. That's a rainbow. Okay. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. He knows that every time go ahead, I go ahead, get go ahead. the camera over here, I get scared. <clears throat> Pat, you did some trout for me. Ooh, that's a good one. He might lose them on purpose. It's your brother. Yeah. yeah. Nope. Holy. The first fish of the day is a good one. Nice and easy. Bend that Don't do what you did yesterday. Yeah. Got it. Pat. Head first, Pat. Yeah, oh baby. my gosh. Yeah. Caught this big one here in Cherokee today. First cast, bobber down, and look what I got. A beauty. Get Somebody get the net. Like, net behind you. Hey, give me your pole. Here, Come on. Daddy, Pat. Yeah. Bam. He's down. <laughs> get the net. I got the Oh, I got the What the? You're, you're right. Yeah. Where's the brook? He's gone. He broke. No. The brook is mine. We see there's a lot of brook trout here in the bottom of this hole. Using a little bit of pink shrimp fireballs. I missed one. We'll see if we can get another one on. Oh my god. You got the net? Oh. Right here, right Check out this big brook trout. I almost took off my shirt when I hooked him. I was so excited. I fished this fish. I missed him my first drift. But patience is key, and I got it. Nice fish. Nice rainbow. Cutting out the ripple. Yeah! I'm going to show you guys how we're fishing today. Uh, really, if you're trout fishing, you just got to learn how to read water. Now we're fishing this big, fast current, and it drops into a slower hole. Now a lot of these fish, they're in two spots. They're in the lower bottom section of the hole, or they're in the very front top on the hole where the current breaks to the slowest part. I'm going to show you how to drift here. We're just working our bobber down on the very slow edge. You see how it's real slow off the break of the current? And the fish, they're sitting right off the break out of the fastest point of the current. See, I just had a bite. But what you, you just want to, if there's fish on the bottom of the hole, you don't want to catch directly at them. You want to catch in front of them and let your bait slowly drift to them. That allows time for your bait to sink to those fish. The brook trout. <laughs> that is absolute king of the brook trout. The, these fish are all staged up. Awesome fall colors on these fish. I mean, just take a look at the patterns. They're beautiful fish. Beautiful kite on this one. You know, you can't get a better looking fish than this one. Now we came up today and drove about 15 minutes outside of town to a familiar place for us. That's Bunches Creek. Now the reason why we came up here, it's a little bit of a smaller stream. It's easier to find the trout, you know. Some of the bigger places like uh, the rivers in downtown Cherokee, you know, Raven Fork, um, those places are a little bit larger and they can be intimidating to some anglers. However, smaller streams like Bunches Creek hold the same fish. They stock the same trout out of the same truck that they do in the bigger systems up here on Bunches Creek. Now we're down from Indian Creek Campground right now, about a half mile. Uh, we found this huge roadside pullout. And anytime you find a roadside pullout or a culvert, 
you know they're gonna stock that place. It makes it easy for their trucks to get in there. So we just came out here on a midweek day and we came armed with two baits. We had pink shrimp Potsky fireballs. Remember, they're not real, but you know what? They look real. Fish can't tell the difference. They're a lot less messy. Caught some really nice brook trout on those today. Now, the other bait is we have two of our friends with us from West Virginia today where golden trout are a big thing. And they catch so many golden trout on yellow jackets that they're kind of attached to them. So they brought their yellow jackets here. And you know what? They caught rainbow trout after rainbow trout after rainbow trout on them. Now, if you're gonna come up and fish a like Cherokee, remember, this water is gin clear. Like you could read a newspaper on the bottom clear. That means two or four pound test is a must. And you wanna use small hooks, size 10, size 12, size 14. You know, yesterday we ran into a guy in the stream and he said, what are you guys doing? Those hooks are way too small for the trout. Well, they're not. His size four was way too big for those trout. Use a smaller hook, use a single salmon egg or a single fireball, and you'll have a chance to have one heck of a day just like we did. Potsky products are available at sporting goods stores near you. If you can't find the specific color, size that you want, make sure to go to potsky.com. And as a thank you for watching Potsky Outdoors, we're going to show you a coupon code to be used for 10% off your next order.